Hey guys, what's up? It's Osama here, and today I'm making my first Sony Vegas tutorial. And um, I'm making it because as soon as I uploaded this video, my new intro, uh, a guy commented on my video and said, please make a tutorial. So um, I don't know if it was good or not, but if you like the intro, which I'll show right now, you can follow the tutorial and make it how I'm going to show you. Or if I don't do a good job on the tutorial, I can always give you my template from which I made the tutorial. So um, I'll just play it and uh, we'll have a look of what we're going to make today in Sony Vegas. So yeah, this was uh, just the intro that I made by myself today. And uh, this was my first ever attempt to make that uh, make this. Also, uh, now to get right into the video, you'll have to go to this link first and download this font which is touchdown and it kind of looks like uh, American football really cool font you can download it and then go to Sony Vegas I have the template here if I don't do a good job as I said before you can always ask me and I can give you the template uh, now when you're in Sony Vegas press ctrl N and from here we'll choose uh, one, one, uh, 1 to 8 0 multiply by 720p uh, 29.970 frames per second this and then we'll pr press ok uh, now you'll uh, have created a project and the first thing that we'll be doing right now is insert video track once you have done that right click and do insert text media and I'll write in my name so I'll just write you make it centrally aligned and uh, make a font a bit big choose 180 for now also the font that we have downloaded is touchdown so I'll select that and um, I don't want it too long so I, I, I want it just like a half of a second for the character to display so I'll make it short like this so uh, we'll see how long it is not too long so uh, what we'll be doing right now is that uh, you have to click here even pen crop and as soon as you see this you can see that there's a transparent thing where the thing goes off and there's a kind of a transparent and solid line so here we want the text fully zoomed in so just enlarge it and yeah when you have this make sure that these two boxes are checked lock aspect ratio inside the watch center so uh, when you're here, put the put the whatever this is called, put it, put it here, and then zoom it in by doing this. We want it like this. So uh, this will be like that, and because there's a hard flash, we'll we'll move it a bit here, like here. So we'll see how it looks now. Looks like looks uh, all right but it kind of looks too slow so try to make it a bit small you can zoom in like right here that looks good so if you preview it it looks like this also uh, once you have done that uh, click on click on this and then go to video fx and go to bump map oh, then select this upper right glow and bring it to the track and now you'll see that it adds kind of a really nice metal look to your text also you can uh, play with this intensity and all that stuff to um, make it however the text suits you best and also th they have a couple of options here I leave it as uh, it is and the bump height is, as you can see here also a really nice thing that you can move this thing to control how from where you want the effect to uh, be generated in your media so I'll put it right here so that there's a shine like here also I'll cross it and after that you'll have to go to transitions and go to flash and do hard flash by the way you do need uh, Sony Vegas Pro 10 because I'm using that and I, I don't know if it works on other versions or not so I'll just navigate here and try to make it also the horizontal diffusion I want it all the way not all the way up but like this so we'll play it and see how it looks that kind of uh, looks alright so uh, the flash is happening off for a bit of time so I'll just put the flash in and see how it looks now um, 
pixels a bit too much so uh, I'll just zoom in the track by doing this and go to pan crop again and I can move this right here so it'll look like this sweet that looks awesome also I can move the flash so that it's not uh, really big now check how this looks that looks good You can, uh, you, you can choose however you want it to happen. Also, I can bring in the flash if I want it to happen at an uh, early time. So that looks better. Yeah, that looks good. So I'll just copy this track, Ctrl C, and go uh, like here and press Ctrl V. Now make sure that you check this option, create a new copy of the social media. And uh, because I'm writing Osama, uh, which is my name, I'll paste it four times. Two. After doing that, you can just change the name, uh, the letters. So U S A M, and after that A. And after that, we'll bring these uh, together. And we'll see how this looks. That looks uh, pretty good so far. Awesome. That looks great. So after that, after once you have done that, uh, we'll go here, right click and do insert text media. Now what I want is that I want to write iPod Touch tutorial, so I'll just write that. And highlight it and touch uh, get the font that I want I want the touchdown font that we just downloaded and put it somewhere where it fits best so yeah I'll make it a uh, 40 and you can make it bold if you want or not italics whatever however you want it to be and after that don't make it too long so go here and so we'll see what happens in the video comes it rotates and as you can see that there's kind of a TV like effect right here and it's kind of uh, like animated so what we'll do is that we'll go to video FX go to add noise and do extreme pull it here and I'll just move it to see how it looks so it looks like this and I can uh, change if I want to reduce the noise level or I can move it up it looks good like right here and uh, now you'll see that the kind of the text kind of looks animated and looks pretty cool. And uh, what happens in the video is that that it gets rotated upwards and then zooms in and there's a hard flash. So uh, yeah, now what we'll be doing is that we'll go to pan crop and move it round about here. And round about here and then we'll rotate this so that it moves faces up that looks, uh, that looks good so uh, once we have done that you'll see how it has changed and you just click and you can see that it will face upwards after uh, after doing that you can go here and now go to the end of the video because we want the text to come uh, here so uh, after going here go here and then Make sure that it's on position, not on mask. And uh, because we want it to merge in, we'll now have to unselect this lock aspect ratio. And you can double click on this window to make it bigger and see how it looks. So we want it to zoom in a bit. My bad, not like that. Like, like that. And you can see that the text is merging in. We can move it up more and move it a bit more here. And bit more let's move it a bit more in and after what I did was that I I moved it like here and then I I did put a zoom in on H so I'll go here and bring it right here so that it's on H and move it adjust it however you want it for example I'll put it like here that, that looks cool and just zoom in
Yeah, right here. So uh, you can see how it looks like when we do that. We just play it and it merges in sweet. And there was a really nice animation. And after that, we'll also need to put a hard flash right here so that you see the kind of effect that you see here at the end of the video. Right here. Right there. Really nice effect. So uh, we'll go to transitions, flash, and hard flash. Put it right here. And also, I'll move it a bit here to, um, to see how it looks like. I don't want the flash to happen yet. So I'll, I'll move the flash from here. And I want it to happen like when it zooms in on H a bit too much so I'll move this and you can see that there's no flash so far I want the flash to happen here so it's on the perfect position I can see here and after that we'll, we want the horizontal diffusion it kind of looks like this and it will create a pretty nice effect on the video so I'll play it and you'll see how it looks like now age and really nice effect as you saw there so um, after doing that just put it here and we'll see how we have made the tutorial uh, the video my bad. Looks like this is A M A and then it shows this merges in and boom, really nice flash. So um this was a just a quick video tutorial on how to make this. Also if you want the sounds you can always ask me and I can give you the template and you can just put in your text all that and all that. So um yeah, this was just a quick tutorial of me showing you how to make this kind of cool intro uh, in Sony Vegas Pro 10. If you like the video, like it. Um, don't put harsh comments because this is my first Sony Vegas uh, video, uh, as I told you before. If you want the template, ask me. And um, yeah, just subscribe if you want more tutorials like this and request anything you want. So yeah, this is Sama, signing out. Peace.